Hey, I got up late, got a lot of emails going this morning. It's 11.15 something, I'm gonna make some breakfast. And we'll be on our way to, I guess Lowe's to get some hardware for the exhaust. I'm gonna show you what I do to take it apart. Probably be struggling with that and uh, we'll see how things go. Food time. Part of the issue. Got some work to do. Had to don the goggles. I don't want to get anything in my eyes because it's kind of crusty in here. And that. I have to get off. And that rusty nonsense. I have to get off. And then the rest is pretty easy. But for right now, that's the pain in the butt. But I saw this today. Was not too happy. Already knew what it was before I even investigated. And here we are. That sucker is split. So I got grease going over it. Luckily, it's fairly recent. But not happy to see it because that's another, I don't know, $100 plus a couple hours. If that's all it is. Been down there for an hour. And got one bolt out. Uh, I found that leak that I showed you a minute ago as well. It took some time searching how much that would be. When you're getting all greasy and you're tearing bolts apart, I'm sorry, tearing your sockets apart, just rip that out. It's time to get out the uh, heat gun. Now is where we're going to have some fun. <laughs> Uh, my fire extinguisher is nearby, just in case. Alright, see if that was enough. Uh, come on! Uh, I think. Oh, I've got it. Yes! So far, I might have to only return one tool today. That's always good. Bolt to the right side of where that is. That's the one that's all rusted in there. You see I got no room. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. I got the front half of my exhaust off. I'm calling a uh, success. I've got 20 minutes left, which is right where I want to be. Another project we got. That's another thing. So coming back here, I decided just to remove, I mean, you can see it, that plate, those two bolts, right behind the tire right now. That was hard to get that bottom bolt off, so I just took the top two off. That's what I did earlier when I changed the head gasket. But now, just take the rubber boots off and it'll be done. Yes. One down, two to go. What's up next? Really was time. For a new muffler. <laughs> all right, all right. Day two. Now I have the old and the new. You can see much improvement. All kinds of issues with the muffler. I mean, there's look, there's a hole in the muffler. Yeah, I've been driving around like that, and that that part rusted off completely. So we'll change this out. The question is, will I be taking the car because this this isn't ready yet, or the scooter? in two hours when I have my dentist appointment. <sighs> That's the question. What do we have here? But a new exhaust. Muffler. I see you with my little eyes. A catalytic converter. And a resonator. So I got attached the, the rear section, but it's coming along. I haven't tightened anything up, just to make sure it all fits, but it seems to be good. I am excited. Because this is a first for me doing exhaust. I think we're going to take the car. We're going to go find out right now. See if it will run. And we'll go from there. Oh. Luckily I have a spare, but sure enough. You saw it happen, I locked myself out.
Okay, so went to the dentist, got my teeth cleaned, and you notice I have the windows rolled down, we'll turn the fan down. The noise is not there. Turn left. Just a little bit of a gargle, if that. So we have a working exhaust again.